Hi everybody, this is Osprey from MyChartCoach.com and we're going to look at ticker symbols MJTK, CBDS, RMHB, and AXIM. Okay, these are marijuana sector stocks. Uh, we follow the OTC. There's uh, currently um, hundreds of stocks that currently trade in the sector and we follow them closely watching for moves like this. MJTK up 175% on Friday. We were actually on this play on Thursday with this bullish volume spike and move above the middle Bollinger Band. Uh, many of the traders in our chat took positions positions and they were rewarded nicely on Friday with this huge 175% move. Okay, what, what happened was there was a high of day close. The last trade of the day was the uh, what was the high of day. And so what needs to be broken is this uh, November 17th high close. And if there's a break above that, there could be a run up here to uh, 0 0.025. Now, uh, the, the next uh, simple moving average target is going to be this 100-day simple moving average at 0 0.0429. Now, the high day close is frothy, especially the fast dough at 100, so there could be a pullback. If there is a pullback, look for the 50-day simple moving average at 0 0.0050 as the uh, key support level to hold. There is a gap on the chart between high of day on Thursday and low of day on Friday, so if there's a pullback below the 50-day moving average, we're going to be looking for the gap to fill and a possible reload on the gap fill. If the if the candles are forming above the 50-day moving average, the, uh, the uh, MJTK will still be bullish, and the 100-day moving average will be the target. If the 50-day moving day average breaks, there'll be downside risk. Now, what we do is we follow the 15-minute chart. If you look here, there was a very strong close. See the high of day close. When there was a breakout on this candle right here at 245, the break above this high, that told you it was wanted to head higher. So just keep that in mind. Whenever you get a break above the high close, that's simply more upside. As long as this middle Bollinger Band is holding, the uptrend is strong. So uh, if it breaks, uh, we, we will be looking to reload lower. Okay, let's look at RMHB. This has a very nice uptrend going. It is uh, uh, filling the jar back to 0 0.07. Notice the break above the middle Bollinger Band down here, and then now above the simple moving averages. This is a very strong uptrend. Okay, so uh, th this should fill the jar back to the 0 0.07 area. 0 0.068 is the high close. If it breaks above that, it could head higher. Okay, this is Rocky Mountain High Brands, a uh, Colorado company. Now, uh, take a look at CBDS, same situation here. Broke the middle Bollinger Band, got above the moving averages here, and now is filling the jar back up to this uh, 7 to 8 range. Now, uh, the high close here in November is the key level to break. Now, if, if, as long as candles keep riding EMAs 4 and 8 higher, this will be a very strong uptrend. CBDS is one of the classics. Okay, so this is a, um, uh, it's good to see that this is running along with the newer, uh, the, the newer uh, uh, companies in the sector. And now another one to look at here is MYHI. Okay, uh, th this is set up here with this uh, um, ascending triangle pattern. Notice how there's this uh, uh, key resistance level to break is the uh, high close here in January. And if there's a break above 21, this could head higher. Fill the break 21 and you might see a pullback. The EMA 13 has been holding, so that will be the key support level. Okay, uh, notice the big volume down here. That's the whole key is to follow the volume. All right, just be sure to... Uh, check us out at MyChartCoach.com and our YouTube channel at MyChartCoach.com for more marijuana sector uh, stock charts and videos. Okay, thank you.